This is question three from a series of videos taking a look at the Edexcel practice papers. Here we're told that R1 buys a car for £4,000. The value of the car depreciates by 10% each year. We're asked to work out the value of the car after two years. So this word here, depreciates, that just means reduces. And we're saying that it's reducing by 10% each year. That each year part is important because it indicates that this is a compound interest, or perhaps you may know it as repeated percentage change. So the way that we're going to do this is we're going to set up a little table. We're going to say that we're going to have year one and year two. And then we're going to have the amount that the car was worth at the start of year one and at the start of year two. How much it depreciated by in each year. And oh, my eyes aren't very good there. And then the last thing is how much it was worth at the end of each year. So at the beginning of year one, what we can say is that Arwen's car was worth £4,000. That's how much Arwen paid for it. Now, it, we're told that it depreciates by 10% each year. So 10% of our 4000 is going to be 400 and so that means that at the end of year one it has reduced by 10 percent 400 pounds so at the end of year one it's now worth 3600 that means that at the start of year two it's worth 3600 it depreciates by 10 percent so our 10% this time is going to be slightly less than it was before because we're now taking 10% of a smaller amount. So our 10% now is going to be worth 360. And so what we're then going to need to do is reduce our 3,600 by 360 pounds and that's going to leave us with 3,240. So our final answer is going to be 3,240. Uh, a quick point here. Um, I imagine that a, a big mistake that most people or some people may have made or the most common mistake that people have made is they would have just calculated 10% of 4,000 and then taken that off uh, twice. So taken off 400 and then taken off 400 again. Be careful about that. The key word that you're always looking for here is each year or each month, um, which will indicate that you need to set up a table similar to this.